everyone it's Ross and today I want to show you guys a tree that needs a little bit of help and uh, I think it's a nice little interesting scenario um, of a really beaten down <laughs> close to death tree and what I would do to fix it I guess so this here is a variety of fig called Black Beauty 10 and I had given this tree to my friend last year and he gave it back to me a year later because during the growing season this year he put an air layer on and we all know when you put on air layers you take off the bark you expose the cambium you expose the hardwood and the roots form here and you get a nice solid air layer I don't exactly know what he did wrong um, you know he's been growing figs longer than I have probably eight or ten years or something as a, as a hobbyist yet this happened <laughs> so no one's perfect but this does create a problem with the tree because this is a very weak point here and the top is actually quite top heavy compared to the trunk the trunk is actually less thick than the top and it goes up and up and up and then branches out would have been a real nice air layer I have to say but like I said, this is really causing structural problems. It can very easily break, snap, just with the wind. That's why I kind of have it against the house here. So what I'm going to do um, to resolve this problem is I'm actually going to cut this right, right here. So everything above this mess up here is going to be gone. Um, I may leave this branch here. Probably not. But I will leave this branch, and this will become the new trunk of the tree. We'll lift this out of the pot, and then plant the root ball on a tilt a little bit, so that this is then really going up in the air. We'll stake this branch up, because this is actually quite a vigorous shoot here. It even branches out here. It's got a nice structure already. So we'll be back in business with this tree in no time and this tree will be fixed and the, you know everything else above that mess up will be uh, taken as cuttings and we'll either give them away or we'll sell them this year in this November um, the last thing I want to mention about this little weird scenario is that there's actually figs on here and my friend had about 15 on here when he gave it to me and I took off most of them and threw them out and there's some I I haven't taken off yet and there's one that actually looked like it was about to ripen today and this is why I took them off because if you look on the inside it's it's inedible it's it's not getting the sugars that it needed um, and this is a real good testament I guess to it's an interesting thing because this fig isn't getting any of the, the sugars that it needs um, to form a tasty fruit, right? But it's been probably been getting some kind of form of carbohydrate throughout the entire year. But in the few days leading up to this problem um, occurring, it just doesn't have the sugars to produce an edible fruit. So even though they turn black, they turn the right color, they get soft, you got to throw them out they're just not getting the nutrients because the sugars are produced in the roots which then goes upwards and then into the fruits into the leaves into the wood and uh, yeah it's just not happening so I thought that whole scenario guys was interesting I hope you you know enjoyed something if you have a weird scenario like this or something crazy and you want my opinion on how to fix it you know um, comment in the comments below um, describing what your tree is like but also I would say a picture is a thousand words so if you really want me to help you get me lots of pictures alright guys take care I hope you enjoyed this one the season is coming to an end it's now October 1st and uh, well then we start we'll, be, we'll start preparing for the winter time and I'll do a couple videos on that so thank you guys stay tuned and I'll see you all later take care